Okay, guys. So, uh, first up, I'm going to do these new releases. Hyo Sung is back with her um, new song called Into You. Um, I have not seen. I saw some teaser photos and I did see one live stage. <clears throat> and the song sounds a lot like uh, the Spice Girls song. What was it? I forgot, <laughs> but it sounds like a Spice Girl song. So without further ado, here's Hyo Sung's Into You. Um, I'm hoping again, because I saw her hair and it was this um, pinkish, like a faded pink orange kind of thing. Um, I do hope that they don't saturate her hair too much. Like they did in the, um, was it the Japanese version of Yuhu? So here we go. I apologize, the lighting is bad and stuff. I'm, I'm using natural sun lighting. So here we go. Oh, I don't even know if it's... Tree. I still haven't found out what TS Entertainment is. Till this day. She's grabbing a taint. What? Memory of perfume? I don't like the lighting, especially in those dark parts. The spotlight is so weird, it kind of cuts off her face in a weird way. Yeah, it sounds like a Spice Girl song. I knew the name, or I was talking about it with people earlier, not earlier, but like a few days back, but I just don't remember what song it was called. She really did that much, but I put it up. There we go. Say you'll be there. That's what it sounds like. I'm very confused with the the sudden concept switch compared to Good Night Kiss. And that so far is the only outfit I like. That like little Girl Scout looking outfit.
every video so far, as of recently, has had the whole sparkling scene at the end. Yeah. I Okay, so that was Kyo Sung's. See if I'll into you. Mm. Spice Girls. Always. So, uh, I was. I thought I was okay. It wasn't amazing. Again, the song sounded completely like a Spice Girl song. Like, let's listen. I'm playing Say You'll Be There. You hear that? Okay, so that was that. Um, poop, call it crazy, whatever you want. Oh, you can see. You can see my phone, but call me crazy or whatever, but it sounds exactly like that. And do you want to go into it again? We will go into it again. You hear that? The thing is, the um, the synths are a bit higher, but everything else sounds there. It's just as far as this one was just made more into a an upbeat pop. Um, the Spice Girls song was a bit different. So anyway, I've taken out a holy shit. Um, so I apologize. But there's only one outfit I liked in the video. Um, she, the lighting kind of made her look very odd. I know she's been, um, she was under fire recently um, around sports competition thing um isac for getting plastic surgery and i do admit she does look a bit different it could again be the lighting because the lighting is a bit weird in this video um choreography uh cl clearly they're um marketing her chest as compared to goodnight kiss um, this is, however, a better song than Goodnight Kiss, personally, because Goodnight Kiss was just a sample of a nursery rhyme. And this one, I mean, granted, it is very, very similar sounding to the Spice Girls' um, Always Be There? You'll Be There? Well, it's a pretty good song. It's, it's not bad, but it's, it's rushed. That's what I feel, it's rushed. I felt TS needed to come out with something so fast. And I'm glad, personally, this wasn't a secret comeback. Because if it was, and if they did do this song, then I probably would have liked it even less. So, again, if you guys enjoyed, please like and subscribe. And what is, what is, what is this? Oh. And I will see you guys later. Bye.